RIDC is an economic development organization. We're a not-for-profit organization that focuses on creating high-quality jobs and enhancing the tax base in Western Pennsylvania. We're helping the region achieve its economic potential. RIDC's role in the region has changed over time as the economy has evolved. Today, more and more, we're going into communities that have suffered economic dislocation. They've seen their mill, their factory close or move out of town, and this has really had a tremendously negative impact on their economy. We step in and work with them in partnership to bring those facilities back to life and to bring jobs and taxes back to those city centers. It's great for the county and the region when we have a big manufacturer come in and take over a huge facility, but when they leave, it's absolutely a disaster. When Sony Manufacturing closed their television plant in Westmoreland County, this was a huge facility, 2.8 million square feet, the state came to us, RIDC, and said, we need you to step in and help bring this facility back to life. Westmoreland County lost upwards of around 3,500 jobs. The impact not only was here in Westmoreland County, but the impact was also across southwestern Pennsylvania and across the tri-state area. So through the RIDC, we've uh, worked it into, instead of having one large entity in the building, uh, we're working to have uh, multiple medium-sized entities in the building. I see a bright future for Westmoreland County because of things like our partnership with the RIDC. You know, one of the unique things that our not-for-profit status allows us to do is we're allowed to look forward and see what's coming down the road in the economy and build to accommodate that. Lawrenceville is an example of that. Our new Lawrenceville facility provides the kind of modern space for the companies we're trying to attract in this region. We have flexible spaces that accommodate technology companies from biotech to life sciences to robotics. Carnegie Robotics is a, we're a six-year-old company. What we do here is engineer and manufacture robotics components and systems. We want to stay in the Lawrenceville area because this is where most of the robotics activity is occurring. Now we really have a world-class showcase here that's great for attracting employees and customers. We do the projects where the public benefit, the jobs, the taxes, the redevelopment of property, the benefits there greatly exceed the profitability of the project. So rather than let those properties sit idle and become eyesores and not generate taxes in the communities that they used to be the centerpiece of, we bring them back to life. Keystone Commons was the former Westinghouse electric manufacturing plant, the plant that electrified the world. RADC began redeveloping the plant several decades ago to create a multi-tenant manufacturing facility in the Mon Valley. Keystone Commons really is perhaps the greatest success story of RADC's existence. It used to have thousands of jobs that sustained two or three or four communities in the Mon Valley, and then they were gone. The buildings were old, there were environmental issues, and yet it had great bones, and through 30 years of investment, there now are some of the most unique production space that exists in southwestern Pennsylvania. Tactile is one of the world's leading manufacturers of ultra high performance concrete. Specifically, our core business is in building facades and innovative building solutions. The RIDC played a huge role in our move to the Keystone Commons and how we would want to utilize the space. They were great about working with us through that process and you know, making sure that we didn't sacrifice on the ultimate outcome of getting a great building that has a, a good future. There was a time when the region just needed jobs and it just needed sites, and RIDC stepped in. But today we have a much more sophisticated and evolved economy. And so RIDC is evolving its mission and its staff and its approach as well. The RIDC really understands the need and the importance that public agencies bring, but also they bring the professionalism of the private sector in terms of a real estate company. 
Every day, over 17,000 people work in RADC parks, contributing over $3 billion to the regional economy. RADC, as a not-for-profit and an economic development organization, we do the projects that can't be done otherwise, the projects that require the long-term view, that require a patient approach, and those that really fundamentally aren't market ready, but nonetheless provide an important function in the communities in which they exist. That's what RIDC does.